Welcome to Crawford International Ramsar, but most importantly, welcome to the Crawford College family. Congratulations on your decision to make us your school of choice. We are very excited to start this college journey with you, and we look forward to the many roads we will travel together. As with the start of something new, there may be feelings of nervousness, excitement, and uncertainty of what to expect. However, feel assured that we are here to guide you every step of the way. My name is Mr. Hansel, and as the Dean of Grade 8, it is my responsibility to make sure that you as parents and students are prepared and well informed as you transition into the college. Rumi once said, it is your road and your road alone. Others may walk it with you, but no one will walk it for you. We encourage each and every one of you to walk this college journey with us with excitement and commitment. The orientation program at Crawford College Ramsar is a fun and interactive way to introduce and incorporate the new grade 8 students into our college family. This introductory program allows the students to engage with their tutors, teachers and the executive body, formerly known as the prefects, in a variety of fun activities and events. All activities and events are designed to get the grade eights to interact with various members of the school and with each other. The orientation program begins with our welcome day in October and culminates in the grade eight induction ceremony in February. From January, we begin with registration day, orientation day, and a camp at Clan Caribe in Bella Bella with the executive body. Unfortunately, we are still unsure whether we are able to attend camp in January next year due to COVID-19. We will therefore send communication to confirm these dates as we near the end of 2020. We will also inform you of our payment plan for camp. We will, however, continue to welcome all our grade eights in an inviting and fun way to start off their college journey in 2021. Please note that we will have a college registration day on the 12th of January 2021. We will send you more information as we near the end of this year. Communication. There are a variety of communication platforms that are used within the college. It is important to note that any information regarding daily concerns such as arriving late for school or absenteeism should be directed to the register teachers. Any subject related matters can be emailed directly to the subject teachers. Information of a more serious nature should be communicated through the grade tutors and dean of grade who will then escalate to the relevant parties be it the academic head or principal. The best form of communication would be via email. Most importantly, let us keep communication open between teachers, students and parents. In the college, we have a number of teachers who are dedicated to looking after your children both personally and academically. We have registered teachers who will see them every morning for registration and grade tutors who are basically their moms and dads in the school, ready to look after them with whatever their needs may be. Then, myself, as I've said before, as the Dean of Grade. To assist with communication, please make sure that you have downloaded the D6 School Communicator. This is used for general communication with parents and students. Important information regarding academic schedules, assessment calendars, term planners, extramural programs, etc. are shared on this platform. Additionally, we have a contact week that is scheduled once a term. In this contact week, Parents will be emailed with regards to the progress of your children and their performance in their various subjects. It is therefore imperative that the correct information is placed on Stacey Portal, as this is the Parent Information Hub. Should the details on Stacey be incorrect, the information regarding students may not reach the desired destination. Instructions of how to update parent details on the Stacey Portal can be found on the D6 Communicator. Let me take a moment to explain our STACY reporting system. STACY is the management system used to issue reports, capture attendance, etc. When you registered your child, you will have received an email with your username and password. Please note and be aware of the following. STACY is used to capture attendance. This is done in the first 10 minutes every morning. Should your child not be present for register, they will be marked absent and parents will receive an automated response. When a child arrives late, they must report to their registered teacher who will correct this attendance status. STACY is also used to issue termly reports. This is done at the beginning of the next term. So for example, Term 1's report is issued at the beginning of Term 2, etc. 
please note that you will need to sign into Stacey in order to access your child's academic report. Three reports are issued every year, Term 1, Term 2 and the Term 3 and 4 final November report. Stacy is also used to hold important information and facilitate communication. Please ensure that your contact details are always up to date, cell phone numbers and email addresses. One parent usually prefers to receive all communication. It is important to ensure that that parent is loaded onto Stacy as P1 or Parent 1 on your child's profile. For any assistance with accessing Stacy and or using the system, please contact the College Secretary Gaynor Ghos at gaghos at crawfordschools.co.za. This email address is in your information booklet. I encourage all our parents when given the opportunity to join our parent WhatsApp group. This WhatsApp group allows myself and the great tutors to be able to send out important information, whether they are daily reminders or important information that we need to get out very quickly. In this way, we can help you as parents and students to stay informed and prepared for coming events. RTSI, textbooks and station. E-learning is an essential part of 21st century education and therefore Crawford International Ramsach has joined forces with RT School Innovation, otherwise known as RTSI, and Blackboard Learn. With this application, students are able to engage with approved textbooks in an unprecedented way. The information regarding the application of RTSI can be found on the D6 Communicator. As from 2021, we are adopting Blackboard Learn into the classroom. Students are to make sure that they have a device on which they can work on online platforms. Unfortunately, smartphones will not suffice. A laptop or tablet is best. Their usernames and passwords will be given to them at the registration day at the beginning of next year. The stationery list and book lists are in the information booklet that you received. Please note that for Grade 8, there are no electronic textbooks and therefore you will not need to access ITSR for Grade 8. Our Crawford Uniform Students are expected and encouraged to wear the school uniform with pride. Please note that as the school transitions from Maragon Ramsar to Crawford International Ramsar, the students have a grace period of two years until the end of 2021 to change into Crawford's multi-form. Please remember that the code of conduct with regards to the uniform is applicable to the student and will depend on whether the student is wearing the Maragon Ramsar uniform or the Crawford International Ramsar uniform. In your information booklet, you can find details about where to purchase this uniform, one of them being our online uniform shop. This uniform shop will once again be open from the 16th of November. It is important for the beginning of 2021 that all grade 8 students have purchased a Crawford sports practice top. Please visit our uniform shop to find out more information on this top. Our extramural activities. It is the aim of Crawford International Ramsach to expose all our students to a wide range of extramural activities and options, and at times, to propel them into the experience. The involvement of all of our students in these codes, as well as inter-house competitions, is encouraged. Please note that all students are encouraged to participate in at least one extramural activity per term. Parental support and motivation has proven to have a huge impact on students' involvements and commitment to any activity. Strong motivation and constant support from parents has a lasting impact on students' development. As you have gone through our welcome drive through today, you will have received various information from our sports offerings, our arts offerings, otherwise known as our cultural offering, and also very importantly, our service programs where we can give back to the school and to our community. Please note that signing up for these activities, as well as the schedule for when they occur, will be given to you at the registration day on the 12th of January, 2021. In our endeavours to keep you well informed and prepared, and to assist students with self-management, please note the following documentation that you can expect next year. At the start of each academic term, with the exception of Term 4, each student will receive the following. An assessment calendar. 
This calendar has all scheduled assessment dates for the term. Please note that these assessments are all formal assessments that need preparation. Any small tasks done within the lessons are not scheduled on this assessment calendar. Please assist your child in using this calendar to help manage their time. A cycle test program for Term 1, when tests will be written. Then an examination timetable for Term 2 and the November final examinations. As well as general academic and compulsory support lesson schedules. And then the extramural program schedules. All the above mentioned documentation will also be made available on the D6 communicator. Our Code of Conduct. You will receive a copy of the Crawford Code of Conduct. Please read through this comprehensive document with your child. Registering as a Crawford student and signing upon registration requires that a student has read through and understood this Code of Conduct. Crawford College. We also offer academic support. Weekly extra lessons are offered in all subjects. In some cases, students will receive letters to attend compulsory extra lessons. Failure to attend these compulsory lessons may hinder students' progress. Students are encouraged to ask their subject teachers for additional help. Thank you for your time with us, and we cannot wait to welcome you officially into our Crawford College family. Please be on the lookout for information throughout the end of this year as we prepare for next year. I would now like to hand over to our executive body, formerly known as the Prefects, to give you some hints and tips on how to succeed in the college. Hey guys, so this is our tip for you. So make sure that you write all your assignments down in a diary on a piece of paper. And then don't be afraid to ask your teachers questions. If you guys are fortunate enough to go to camp, enjoy the camp. If you guys have any events as a grade, enjoy those. And if you see any of the executives in the hallways, don't be afraid to ask for help. No matter how intimidating we look, we're always here for you guys, no matter what. Hi guys, um, my tip for you guys for surviving high school would be get into the extra murals at school. It really does help take your mind off the schoolwork. The one thing I wish I knew before I came to the college was how important greeting actually is. So please just don't forget to greet all your teachers by ma'am and sir or any parents who see you walking around the school. It is the best experience you'll ever have. And the most important one and the only one, make your mark. You don't want to be the person that no one remembers after they graduate. So I know it sounds corny and stuff, but it's true what the teachers say. Participate in as much activities as possible, whether it be sport, service or culture. Here is where you make the most hilarious memories ever and unbreakable friendships. I mean, obviously, focus on academics, but have fun, leave your hair down and just, oh, I can't wait to meet you all next year and I know you'll love college life.